Hi, in this video I'm going to do a follow-up on the previous video I did with uh, consumption tests. Last time I did a consumption test with my 20-inch summer tires and now I have my 19-inch winter tires on. So will there be any difference in consumption? Let's see. And by the way, if you enjoy my content, please consider to hit like and subscribe. That would be highly appreciated. Thanks. So let's uh, just reset everything here and um, and just like last time the car has been preheated for 30 minutes and it's been on the charger for about two hours. Uh, so we have the similar conditions, even outside conditions now the temperature is 7 degrees and the road is dry. So last time it was between 7 and 8 degrees. So. Uh, it's pretty similar to the last time. So let's see how it goes. Okay, so we are halfway through the consumption test route and let's check out the result halfway. As we can see, we are at 19 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers. And just see here, this one, yep, yeah, 19. Yeah. Average speed was 63 kilometers. We've driven 33.9 kilometers. So let's head back and see the end results. Okay, we are back now and let's check out the results. As we can see here, 18.8 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers. It was actually 18.7 when I parked, so it's gone up just by 0.1. And yeah, the average speed is now 62. It was 63, so it's been it went down one kilometer per hour. What does that mean? So, with the 20 inch wheels, the, wind, the summer tires, we got 19.9, which equaled around 375 kilometers range. And with the winter tires 19 inch wheels we got 18.7 so 401 kilometers so you can see that if you want if you need better range 19 inch wheels will be better for sure that's it for now and uh, until next time see you and by the way remember to hit like and subscribe yeah bye